<laughs> there he is. He's up there in this tree here. I had a shot on him a couple times and uh, he kept moving around. I was under him. Where'd he go? He's coming down. He came down a little bit. Missed, so I knew I missed him. Right under the head. He came down this main branch a little bit. I don't know where he, there he is. Get him, Max. That's gonna be tough. Is he gonna stop? Is he gonna stop? Yep. Push him back up, Max. Come on. Ah. On this main tree here. <laughs> oh, he moved. I saw him jump for a split second. Is he up there? My chance before he started timbering, but once he started timbering, uh, stop moving you. Got him. <laughs> yeah, good boy. Good boy, Max. Bring him here, Max. Catch him. So he's not retrieving, so that means um, when I go up on the squirrel, we're done. There's no him trying to grab it, there's no playing with it. It's just we're done because he wants. He's starting to want me to grab it so he can play with it, and he likes that excitement. And I want him to learn to just bring it back to me, and I'll reward you. You got guts all over you, Max. You okay? Okay, yeah, it's a squirrel. No. All right, let's go, go get him. The other thing too, now that he's older, he's not a puppy, we're working a lot more on the impulse control. Sweet, let's go, on to the next one. Oh, he's about to. Good boy. He ran up here somewhere. Oh, I missed. Good luck catching this guy. I lost him in the sun. Get him, Max. He's losing his poor little voice. God, I can't. I can't see anything up in that tree. There's his tail. I need to rest on something tight. Well, I've never had that happen where you shoot it and it gets stuck up in the tree. He got stuck up there where I could see his tail and his hams, but not his head. And he was kind of, if I shot him, he'd go back up there. So he's dead. I put a, I shot him in the hams. It only pushed him back up into this little flat spot. And then I couldn't see any of him except his tail floating around. It's kind of part of squirrel hunting, I guess, and do your best to not let it happen again. But I still would have taken that shot again because there's no way I would have anticipated him staying up there. But we'll keep going. It sucks. I'm going to count that towards my limit just because, you know, I shot it, I saw it die, and I just couldn't retrieve it. So we'll move on to the next one. Oh, what is it? I'm trying. I'm coming. Okay. Is this the tree you like? Good boy. Um, I doubt that. Yep, there was one. Max. Get him, Max. He's <laughs> over there.
got him. Oh, come down. Yes, thank you. Goes to show. <laughs> Trust your damn dog. I went for a rib shot, but he was a good eight, 70 yards away or so. Bloody tongue max. Give me the score. Okay, that's not his blood. It's funny how that last one made me, uh, I came down here with Max and then he went to the bottom of the hill so I followed him. And then when I got down here, I was like, there's no squirrel in that little pine tree. Cause he was kind of treeing a couple trees around the area. And then he locked in on this one. So I was like, okay, whatever, I'll see what's going on. And I kicked the pine tree like an idiot. Of course, the squirrel timbers all the way back up the freaking mountain and hill, so I can't catch him. So between me slipping and falling all over these mountains and I was able to kind of get an offhand shot at 70 yards and hit that squirrel in the neck. I'll take it. Cannot complain. All right, no squirrel. No squirrel. Hey. <laughs> Came back looking for me. I like it. Day before Thanksgiving, nice weather out. A couple hours before evening. I want to take the A-team out. Haven't had Max out in about two weeks. He really hasn't had a voice for the past week or so. And uh, finally getting it back a little bit. So here we are hunting. Uh-huh. All right, no squirrel, let's go, come on. Oh. 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 Huh. Oh. That's really thick right there. Oh. 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 Yep, there he is, okay. Taking this guy out. There you go. Oh. Good shot. Bring him here, Max. Hey, give me. Get him. Man, you got all kinds of squirrel blood all over you, dude. Bag, I think we actually shot four of those, so we're gonna count four out of the six towards our limit today. Ah, go. Nice. Nice shot. All right. <laughs> Four out of six, two more to go. It's a great day for squirrels. They're out in all kinds of, they're in the thicker stuff. They're in some of the more open stuff. They're just out, good weather. It's a little bit hot for me, but the, the squirrels are doing good. <laughs> On to the next one. Well, tell me if you guys can see anything. <laughs> all right, no squirrel, let's go, come on. Wow, how the f do you get there? He just took our way down this shit. Uh, oh, sounds like he's on the ground and he's chasing after it. Holy shit. Oh, over here. That's a den tree. It looks like what happened is it was up in the tree and started timbering and then it went on the ground and took off and he chased it over here and usually when they get on the ground and take off 
They'll uh, find a den pretty quick, but maybe he's up here. <coughs> There's almost no chance I was going to get that because I was up in some godforsaken field up there. There's no way I was going to get down here. Hey, no squirrel, Max. Come on, let's go. No squirrel. Where are you? Oh, it's a possum. There he is. Oh. <laughs> Cute little guy. Yeah, I'm not in the mood for eating one right now. And I don't want Max really treating him too much, so. Come on, Max, let's go. No squirrel, come on. <laughs> he really wants him. Come on, Max. I'm sure he doesn't decide to go back there a half mile and go check him out again. Yep. Where'd he go? Uh, I guess I'm going down in there. I had about a split second where I could have shot it, but it never stopped. Now I gotta go down in here. Where did you go? Oh, that was the tree. I see you, Max. Don't worry. Got nowhere to go, puppy. The importance of resting on a tree and taking your time, holy shit. Cause like when you're running through here, you get out of breath and maybe not really out of breath, but you're just breathing a little heavier. It's almost impossible to shoot off hand, especially at the end of the day, you've been walking around for four or five hours. Come on. Easy. Dark route, working our way back to the truck. We got uh, five today, four in the bag. Doing pretty good, still really impressed with Max, but that's gonna wrap it up. See you guys in the next one.